Here's a nice new ability in Separation Studio 4. Each time you open a new art file, the colors are instantly analyzed. Spot colors are retained, while process colors are automatically converted to useful spot colors. You can even add new colors to your custom library in two different ways. The first is to go up to the Edit drop-down menu. Then go to Inks. And here we have a custom inks window. To create a new one, we press the plus button. And here we have a default color and named ink. To change this, we click the drop down menu. And from here, we can either put in our colors freeform or type them in exactly. For this, we'll just do them freeform. Great, now we can name it whatever we want. We go up here. Perfect. We can click Accept and it'll be saved in our library. Now if we want to change the color of a separation to our new ink, all we have to do is double click on any of our separations to open the Document Properties window. And then we can click the drop down menu of the one we want to change. And our new ink is already there in the library. Now what if we wanted to add the color that came with it and use it in future projects? We just have to click the plus icon next to the automatically created color for the separations in our art file. Here it's auto-filled with the name and the exact color information that came with it. We can just press accept and it's now saved in our ink library. Let's see what the proof positive looks like. Wonderful. Now anytime I'd like to apply this color to another separation or if I open another file that uses the exact same RGB or CMYK colors as this one, the color name will automatically be applied to that separation. Fast, simple, and smart. Freehand and you. Together, we got this.